Hi, my name is Liu Tong, Assistant Professor in Division of Environmental Science Development. Our division aims to nurture individuals who will acquire expertise and research abilities in finding solutions to global and local environmental issues to create a sustainable society. There are four courses available in our division, Human and Ecological Systems, um, Environmental Adaptation Science, Practical Science of Environment, and Global Ma Environmental Management. We welcome students with diverse educational and cultural backgrounds. And my name is Stefan Lowe and I'm a South African, but I've been living here for about a little bit more than three years. So I did my master's degree here and now doing PhD and I'm in the course of global environmental management. Um, there's like four divisions, but uh, it feels to me like the other divisions are a little bit more pure science, but the environmental science development division focuses more like on the applied side of environmental science. So like, and I like that, how to try and really solve some environmental issue like pollution or um, something attracted me. And also because in the division of environmental science development, there is the GEM course, Global Environmental Management, which is an English based course. I was attracted by the research topics of my own supervisor and that's why I actually chose the university in the first place. My journey at the university kind of began through my current supervisor. So before I, um, I like enrolled to the graduate school, I saw the research um, of my supervisor on his own personal website, um, which is linked to the university's um, website, I think. And then so, uh, I was interested and then I contact, contacted him directly by email and then after that he helped me to the, with the procedure of enrolling into the school. So my research topic is about um, waste landfill sites and m my laboratory works on s spatial data like um, or spatial data and r remote sensing satellite data. Particularly my research is focusing on like improving the availability of data for being able to measure the SDGs, the progress. So um, yeah, which is one a very important part of the SDGs. So. I think inside Japan, Okada University is quite highly regarded. So um, the faculty members that the university has are I, I, quite um, experts in their field. We can get that um, feeling. So. I, I think um, generally everything is like at a very high standard. So my future goal at the moment is to be able to become like a researcher or um, like assistant professor or something like that. I, I'm like in my second year of my PhD. I hope that if I finish here, I can, if I can like get some a researcher position or postdoc in Hokkaido University, in this university, um, that would be like my, that would be great. <laughs> the faculty members can speak English and actually it's not really important to be able to understand Japanese, but the university also has free um, good language courses that we can take. So, um, just like try to apply, just contact some supervisor, it's, it's a good idea. My name is Ralf Greve, a professor in the Division of Earth System Science. Our division offers three exciting courses, Atmosphere, Ocean and Climate Dynamics, Biochemistry and Cryosphere Science, addressing different facets of Earth sciences. Students uncover the mysteries of environmental changes on local to global scales in the past, present and future and gain broad expertise from fundamental to advanced levels. Join us for a captivating journey of exploration and discovery. My name is Zarine Bikmulina. 
am a second year master course student in biogeochemistry. I chose my sensei because he is amazing and I really wanted to work under his supervision. But the scope of the division is also matching my interests. We study palo environment biomarkers, metabolites of vertebrates that can help us understand the agriculture practices of the past. We take soils or sediment cores and find their molecules, the tracers. In my undergraduate study, I was focused in soil science. Here, I could more focus on biogeochemical cycles. Also, I personally like, like geomorphology, uh, geology, and additional courses I could take, as an example, in remote sensing, uh, geological hazards, could cover even this aspect. As for research environment, uh, there is very good equipment in the laboratories, very good support from supervisors. Furthermore, we frequently present our internal results on small meetings and we get feedbacks from the professors of the department and it helps to improve the study. I'm really happy to be surrounded by people from different countries with different backgrounds, so it's very diverse and we can know each other, uh, Bangla, Indian, Japanese, all together. And uh, I think in general it's very friendly, so we share the same research space and we learn how to live and do research together. I'm so encouraged by the delivery from the professors. So I want to be professor in university and to share the knowledge to make students interested because I know that professors here really like what they are doing and I also like and I want to share this love with students. If you are interested in environment and Palo environment, if you like to get broader knowledge on processes occurring in the earth, welcome to Hokudai. <laughs>